Two suspects are on the loose after trying to set a house on fire with a Molotov cocktail. It happened on Hearthside Court in the Indian River area. Ten on your side's Raven Payne is live in Chesapeake with the latest on the search and their motive behind the attack. Raven. Yes, well, as far as a motive, no one really knows why someone would do something like this. Neighbors tell me the homeowner is an elderly woman who has lived in the neighborhood for a long time. And apparently this isn't the first time something like this has happened to her. I spoke with a man who tells me he's the grandson of one of the arson victims. He tells me there have been two arson incidents at his grandma's house. Now this video shows a suspect throwing a Molotov cocktail at a house on Hearthside Court in Chesapeake. They appear to be wearing black jeans with a white design near the pocket and a dark blue jacket with a hood. And this happened just two days ago. The Chesapeake Fire Marshal's office tells us suspects use a cinder block to break the window, trying to throw the Molotov cocktail into the home. This is one of two arson incidents that have happened at this home, the first happening on December 19th. According to the fire marshal's office, suspects use a rock to break glass in that crime. Neighbors say these are definitely targeted attacks, but they have no idea why. One man declined to show his face or name, but tells me his mom was the first to tell him about the incidents. When she told me, it was like, you know what I'm saying, who would want to mess with her? Because she old, you know what I'm saying, she's been out here for a long time. So, like I said, don't nobody bother her, she don't bother nobody, she'll come out. The only time you'll see her is like if she take her trash out, you know what I'm saying, and go back in the house. But you know, that's like, I don't know, it's just crazy. Like, it's, it's real wild for somebody to like mess with her because she old. And the fire marshal's office says the suspect shown in that video fled on foot toward Allison Drive. Coming up at 10 and 11, more about what happened during that first arson attack in December. Live in Chesapeake, Raven Payne, 10 on your side.